<laughs> What's going on? You idiots ready? Oh, Hades, I, you, have uh, you not been paying attention, Hades? I literally just hit start recording. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> I, I kind of I tuned you out at that point. <laughs> well, you're in for it now. <laughs> Nobody likes to hear you talk, Tone. Uh, that's literally the reason why we come on here. This story is called Licky Flitter by Hap. I'll be contacting them later to ask if it's okay if I post this madness. Oh, oh God. If they say yes, well, you'll know because it's on YouTube. Anyways, I'm kind of... Fallen, in... I, fallen I blame you. <laughs> A wise thing. Uh, I'll take full responsibility. <laughs> yes. Ah, that's horrible. Oh, fuck. <laughs> no, the name of the chapter is Lick Lick in asterisk, so I just licked my pop filter because I'm a goddamn idiot. <laughs> it tastes gross. Yeah. Not doing that again. It's called Lick Lick. Anyways. Fun fact, YouTube. Skajaram is here, ha has a cold, and he's doing this just for the fun of it. I mean, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> I, I have. I, and pickles. Yeah, I, I mean, I can't do a good quality recording with my voice this fucked, so might as well just do some madness. So just do some madness and just throw some random shit in there. Yep. Anyways, oh, lick damn. lick. Rimadash woke up and said, Wow, that was a crazy nightmare. Good thing it had a happy ending. She looked around and said, Hey, I saw some pony here. Because she is fast and she woke up fast and saw some pony before they could run away. <laughs> <laughs> I'm already loving this, just straight up. Uh, Ramadash flew out of her bedroom, but didn't see any pony, even though she was really fast. She scratched her head and thought back to the time that she tried to run away from run away, run away from Peaky Pie's party invitation, and other various times. You said these were all one on run on sentences. Uh, yes. Yeah, so when you get into the later ones, it's just paragraphs of run on sentences. You over better and over again. Don't let me down. Anyways, the only pony faster than Raymond Ash is Pinky, and only because she cheated. Raymond Ash grinned because <laughs> if a creepy pony watches her sleep, then it is fair to cheat to catch this creepy pony. So Raymond Ash went to go find Pinkie Pie, but Pinkie Pie wasn't interested in catching the creepy pony who watches Raymond Ash sleep. She thought it was boring and wanted to have fun instead. But then Rainbow Dash went to Sugar Keep Corner and bought two cakes because she remembered Discord talking about how much fun that was. She gave one to Pinkie Pie and told her she could have the other if she helped find the creepy sleep-watching pony. But the cake itself isn't that much fun, so Pinkie Pie wanted to have a party. <clears throat> a little uh, side note here. The creepy sleep-watching pony is actually Edward from the Twilight Saga. <laughs> wow. So they went to Fluttershy's house because Fluttershy has practiced with two cake parties. She does. And they had a party, and then Pinkie Pie said, okay. <laughs> I was fast. <laughs> Love the pacing. Pinkie Pie watched Raymond Ash sleep. Raymond Ash said it would be exciting, but Pinkie got bored and started counting cloud bugs that only live in cloud houses because Raymond Ash's house is a cloud house. But bugs are pretty boring, too, so Pinkie Pie fell asleep and had a nightmare about bugs until Princess Luna came and scared away the bugs and also gave Pinkie Pie a bunch of cupcakes <laughs> that didn't have bugs on them or in them. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Remember to bring me getting into the map. <laughs> <laughs> All the red hot sentences. But Raymond Ash there woke up and. Dharma is going to suffocate himself with these. Yep. <laughs> but Raymond Ash woke up and saw a pony watching Pinkie Pie sleep, and she heard a flapping noise like a dog licking its lips, and she tried to chase the pony, but the pony was too fast, and she couldn't catch the pony because she couldn't <laughs> catch the pony because obviously the author said she couldn't catch the pony because she wrote it so. He, she, I don't fucking know what gender the author is. <laughs> and Pinkie Pie woke up, Raymond Ash was gone, and then came back and said, That creepy pony who watches asleep is too fast for me to catch. And I'm super fast, so that pony has to be super duper fast, so we have to cheat. Now! <laughs> uh, I wanted to make, like, a, a, a rainbow pinky cheating on each other joke, but no, no. You're gonna need a new voice soon enough. Just oh god, bear with uh, it. I'm reading this whole thing blind, by the way. <laughs> so. Yeah. <laughs> so they went to Twilight Sparkle, who refused to help because it was stupid. So they went to Zakora instead, who rhymed a lot, and Raymond Ash got really annoyed, but... Finally, Zakora gave them a potion that would combine Raymond Ash's awesome speed and Pinkie Pie's cheating so they could catch the creepy sleep-watching pony who was secretly Edward. Yeah, they took the... 
they this took that's not gonna end badly. They took the potion no. and Rainbow Dash, and Pinkie Pie became one pony with pink fur and a curly rainbow. Maya just brushed up against my leg. <laughs> Ew. I was about to say they're talking about your cat in the fic, Tom. No, no, Maya just walked in here, and, and now she ran away. Okay, back to the story. <laughs> I say she was caught. Jig was up. <laughs> no. They took the they took the potion and Raymond Ash and Pinkie Pie became one pony with pink fur and a curly rainbow mane who was super fast and also could cheat and beat places faster than the fastest pony. So now Rainbow Pie didn't Pinkie Pie bake one of those once? Was one pony <laughs> and could catch the creepy sleep watching pony. All they needed to do was have a nightmare and then they knew the pony <laughs> would be there. Since Raymond Ash and Pinkie Pie together is so awesome, what kind of thing could give them nightmares? Only one thing. It's clowns. <laughs> yeah, it's clowns. So Rainbow Pie went to the circus and met clowns. Also an elephant and a pony who hit lions with a chair, which wasn't very nice, so it's a good thing that Rainbow Pie didn't bring Fluttershy. <laughs> and the clowns were scary, so Rainbow Pie had nightmares. Only because of Pinkie Pie's cheating, Rainbow Pie woke up right when Princess Luna was about to show up, and they saw the creepy pony who was a lilac pegasus flapping her tongue around. The pegasus was really pretty and had light blue hair with a purple bow in it, but the hair wasn't spiky, so it wasn't Cloud Chaser. The pony was Flitter! <gasps> <laughs> Rainbow yes. Pie zoomed out of the room to catch up to Flitter, but she was too fast, and so Rainbow Pie had to cheat. But that's what Pinkie Pie is good at. And, uh, blah, blah, blah. But that's what Pinkie Pie is good at if you're talking about the laws of physics, but not games. Because Pinkie Pie doesn't cheat at games, because if you cheat at games, then it's not fun even if you win, because that is how the logic works. But this wasn't a game. This was life and death. It was? <laughs> Sleep and dreams. That it is. Nightmares and flappy tongues. Eh? Yeah. <laughs> then, because of Pinkie Pie's cheating powers, Rainbow Pie caught up to Flitter, who was standing over Twilight Sparkle, who was mumbling about quesadillas and cheese and crying in her sleep. <laughs> quesadillas! <laughs> Rainbow Pie tackled Flitter, but Flitter's tongue flopped all over and got in Rainbow Pie's ear, and then Rainbow Pie fell asleep. What? <laughs> Princess <laughs> Luna. Princess Luna was very confused when Rainbow Pie showed up and stepped in cheese because the world was made of cheese and there was cheese everywhere. Twilight was crying because there was so much fucking cheese. <laughs> Princess Luna said, you're not part of Twilight's nightmare. Then Twilight said, she is now. What is that thing? So Rainbow Pie <laughs> said, it's me, Rainbow Dash and Pinkie Pie. We oh caught the creepy pony who watches every pony sleep. And yeah, I'm just bouncing back and forth between their voices with every word because that makes sense. Like the rest of this goddamn story does. Yep. I am really weird when I have a cold. <laughs> yep. And we're mm. here for the ride. Welcome. Thanks. I hope you're enjoying yourself. <laughs> oh, this is just great. Princess Luna said, we have to talk. And they were in the library again and every pony was awake and Twilight sat up and pointed at Rainbow Pie and screamed, Oh God, it's real! <laughs> Rainbow Pie rubbed her ear when it was wet from being licked by Flitter and looked around because Flitter was gone again. Princess Luna said, okay, Flitter, you can come out. Flitter came out of nowhere, just like Pinkie Pie did all the time, except every pony could see Pinkie Pie because she wasn't super fast like Flitter is. Flitter's tongue kept flopping around everywhere and made a wet slapping noise and just looked really weird. And Rainbow Pie kept staring and kind of wanted to poke it, but remembered how weird it was when it hit her in the ear, so she did not poke it because... She did not poke it. <laughs> Princess Luna said, This is Flitter. Her tongue is the real power behind saving ponies from nightmares. Twilight said, But she's not even a princess and you're a princess, so why don't you have the power? Flitter flapped her tongue around as if she wanted to lick all of the things, and Rainbow Pie wasn't sure it was a bad idea. Princess Luna said, It was always Flitter's power and not mine that saved ponies from their nightmares, like the singing flowers and the cheese world and... All the other bad things. But she was so fast that until now, no pony ever saw her. So no pony noticed that she had to lick sleeping ponies so I could enter their nightmares to banish the bad dreams. So they can have good dreams and not bad dreams. Uh, 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 fucking <laughs> raw senses. God damn it. <laughs> Rainbow Pie said. Passed out on us? No, I'm fine. Yeah. Rainbow Pie said. Oh, so Flitter's licking power saves every pony from their nightmares. But why did she stick her tongue in my ear? <laughs> That's how the power works, Rainbow Pie, said Princess Luna, somehow knowing that Rainbow Dash and Pinkie Pie combined was Rainbow Pie and that this weird pony was Rainbow Pie. <laughs> That's why she is super fast and no pony can see her. She likes Pony Santa Claus, but for bad dreams instead of presents because she has to visit so many ponies every night to save them from their bad dreams instead of giving them presents. 
<laughs> Twilight Sparkle clutched her sheets closer to her chest and screamed, PLEASE MAKE IT GO AWAY! I agree. <laughs> Princess Luna yeah. said, okay, fine, and turned Rainbow Pie back into Rainbow Dash and Pinkie Pie. And then Twilight Sparkle stopped freaking out and was happy to have her friends back, and Rainbow Dash was okay sleeping now that she knew that Flitter was licking her in her sleep uh, <laughs> to, protect her, to protect her from nightmares. And Pinkie Pie was happy to have her second kick, and Princess Luna kept every pony safe from their dreams because Flitter was able to lick every pony when they had nightmares so Princess Luna could save them from their bad dreams. The fucking end. Oh, my God. <laughs> And that, uh, ladies and gentlemen, was Skijarama's reading with a cold. That uh, made you scream. Yes, that Honestly, is exactly the best what thing that is. in the world, if you ask me. Yes. All right. So, you feel better, Tom? Not really. You okay there? I mean, like. I'd say you probably just destroyed his voice now. I'm, I'm, I'm okay. I'm, I'm, I'm fine. I'm okay, really. I'm good. Yeah, just, whatever you do, just don't think of the rainbow pie. And don't think that Flitter licks you and you're sick. <laughs> <laughs> Make it, I was trying to Make it go away!